One more game to go. It's the MLS Cup Final. It features the Philadelphia Union and LAFC. With Danny Higginbottom, I'm JP Della Camera. Danny, you've played in many finals in your career. What's it like? What changes for a final? Nerves. I think that, that's the big thing. You know, the, the, the players, they will just want to get on with this game. The build-up has been obviously different to, to what would be a normal game. And I think they just want to get on that pitch, get the first touch, get the confidence, and then grow into the game. So that's going to be a huge thing, no question. I've heard coaches say, play the game, enjoy the game, yeah. have fun. How can you do that with so much pressure riding on one game, one it result? Is, it is very difficult because as a player, just going back to leading up to the game, you think about all the scenarios. You think about winning, you think about losing, about how you're going to feel. And it's just trying to get that order right. It's just trying to get all the positive thoughts. And with Jim Curtin, we know as a man manager, he's absolutely magnificent. So he'll have the players in the right frame of mind because you don't want to be too wound up. Yeah. You don't want to be too relaxed. So it's just important to get that level right. It's a dream final. Union come in, number one offense during the regular season, number one defense, LAFC, number two offense, number three defense. Where can this game be won? Oof, I think early on in the game, the home field advantage, I think, can be huge, but it can go against you as well. And I think from Union's perspective, they'll want to quieten the fans down. And then what you find is that, because we know LAFC, they've got great fans, but if you can quieten the fans down, and all of a sudden you start to hear the Philadelphia Union fans, you know that that's part of the job done. So I think that will be part of the plan from Union early on. Just keep concentrated, hold tight, and don't give LAFC any early opportunities. Then you can grow into the game yourself. Other than goalkeepers, let's talk about field players and who could impact this game. For me, it's Jose Martinez for the Philadelphia Union, Ilya Sanchez for LAFC. Pick two. Yeah, I, I, would, I would say the two players that you mentioned are, are going to be vitally important, especially in, in front of the two centre-backs in particular for LAFC. But I think because it's going to be a congested game, I think it's going to be a game of inches, so to speak. There's going to be not many measures between, between the two teams. I'm going to go with Garsdog, your traditional number 10. Been outstanding this season, MVP candidate who can always find space in, in difficult areas, and Vela as well for LAFC. We know that he'll predominantly start on the right-hand side. He goes over to left, but he's very good at drifting into that 10 position. So the plays that you've just mentioned obviously coincide with the plays that I mentioned. It's important that they're at the top of their game. We're hoping for a dream final. Join us for MLS Cup 2022 on PhiladelphiaUnion.com.